The legend lives on from the Chippewa on down Of the big lake they call Gitchagumi The lake it is said never gives up her dead When the skies of November turn gloomy With a load of iron ore, 26,000 tons more Than the Edmund Fitzgerald weighed empty that good ship and true was a bone to be chewed when the gales of November came early. The ship was the pride of the American side, coming back from some mill in Wisconsin. As the big freighters go, it was bigger than most, with a crew and good captain well seasoned. Concluding some terms with a couple of steel firms When they left fully loaded for Cleveland Then later that night when the ship's bell rang Could it be the north wind they'd been feeling? The tattletale sound and the wave broke over the railing. And every man knew as the captain did too, it was the witch of November come stealing. The dawn came late and the breakfast had to wait when the gales of November came slashing. When afternoon came, it was freezing rain. In the face of a hurricane west wind When supper time came the old cook came on deck saying Fellas it's too rough to feed you at 7 p.m. a main hatchway gave in He said, fellas, it's been good to know ya The captain wired in, he had water coming in And the good ship and crew was in peril Later that night when his lights went out of sight Came the wreck of the Edmund Fitzgerald Does anyone know where the love of God goes When the waves turn the minutes to hours? The searchers all say they'd have made whitefish pay If they'd put fifteen more miles behind her They might have split up or they might have capsized They may have broke deep and took water all that remains is the faces and the names of the wives and the sons and the daughters. Lake Huron Roll Superior Sings in the rooms of her ice water mansion. Old Michigan steams like a young man's dreams. The islands and bays are for sportsmen. And farther below Lake Ontario takes in what Lake Erie can send her. The iron boats go as the mariners all go with the gales of November remembered.
joy at day parade in the Maritime Sailors Cathedral. The church bell chimed till it rang 29 times for each man on the Edmund Fitzgerald. And the legend lives on from the Chippewa down of the big lake they call Gitchigumi. Superior, they said, never gets up for dead when the gales of November come early. Chippewa on down at the big lake they call Gitchagumi. The lake, it is said, never gives up her dead when the skies of November turn gloomy. With a load of iron ore, 26,000 tons more than the Edmund Fitzgerald weighed empty. That good ship and true was a bone to be chewed when the gales of November came early. The ship was the pride of the American side, coming back from some mill in Wisconsin. As the big freighters go, it was bigger than most, with a crew and good captain well seasoned. Concluding some terms with a couple of steel firms When they left fully loaded for Cleveland Then later that night when the ship's bell rang Could it be the north wind they'd been feeling? The wind and the wires made a tattletale sound and the wave broke over the railing And every man knew as the captain did too T'was the witch of November come stealing The dawn came late and the breakfast had to wait When the gales of November came slashing 